Going the wrong way. Hi guys, Ultimate Yoshi here, and we are playing more Skyward. S ah, what? Sword. In the last time, is this the right way? No. Last time we checked around Skyloft, finished collecting all the Goddess cubes, and Groose fell down with us, and it's probably gonna try and muck everything up for us. Unintentionally, of course. He has good intentions. He's just an idiot. He's gross. Gross is setting the definition of idiots. Anyways. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, Granny. Uh-oh. You're messing with me. Say it again, I dare you. I only speak the truth. You are not the one who will save her. The spirit made in your Zelda can only be saved by another. It has been his fate to do this thing, and in doing so save us. As it as it was decided long ago before you were brought crying into this world. <laughs> Shut it, Granny! You obviously don't know me well, because if you did, you'd know that if anyone's gonna save Zelda, it's gross. How could it not be me? Plus, if it ain't me, why would I even be here? Pfft. I'm not up... If I'm not up to the job of being the hero, just who is? No. Huh? Hi there. Oh, now I getcha. Link, Granny here has been trying to tell me that you're gonna be the big hero who rescues Zelda. <laughs> what a joke. Look, all I've heard so far is a bunch of babbling about destiny, but that's a load of garbage. I know you and you're no hero, shrimp. Um, who's the one who defeated Girahim, Skaldora, and... Two cubic tons of scorpions. I still don't remember her, his name. <laughs> so stupid. We... <laughs> I even named it the title of a video, it's like Maldrick or something. I think. Maybe. Greetings, Link. Were you able to catch up with Zelda? I don't remember her voice at all. I don't remember what I had her voice, so I'm just making one up. Ah, I see. So the Guardian was there as well, was she? The one you saw by Zelda's side is known as Impa. She is being sent forth by the Goddess to aid Zelda in her quest. Being? Is she not human? Um... The two have traveled somewhere in order to accomplish the great task Destiny has set before them. However, now that Impa has destroyed the gate that they used, there is only one way left to find them. You must make use of the harp. I'm still convinced it's a liar, but whatever. Given to you by Zelda. Mm -hmm. Tell me, Link, have you attempted to play the harp that you received? My sense is that you have not yet familiar familiarized yourself with it. Very well, I shall teach you how to play. Listen well and do as I say. First, press up to ready your harp. And then press A to prepare to stun it. Point the Wiimote forward and press... This is really hard. Good, you learn fast. Now for your next lesson. I'm worried. Focus and play in time with the pulsing of the circle of light. When your timing is right, I shall join my voice to your harp. I don't want to hear your voice! Listen well, for the song I sing will be a great help to you in your journey. Not that hard. Mm. 
you learn the Ballad of the Goddess. That's the song I remember. It's a mysterious melody that has been passed down from ancient times. Ah. Uh. It's shiny. Mm. The harp you hold is known as the goddess's harp. It is a divine instrument of the goddess who once watched over this land. Mm. The melodies it brings to life have the power to produce a variety of strange and otherworldly worldly effects. The great slab standing before you is known as a gate of time. It is the last of its kind in existence, the only portal binding our world to the one where Zelda now resides. If you manage to open the gate and pass through, you will likely end up in the same place as Zelda. But you will need to endure, endure many hardships and put yourself in great danger to awaken the gate from its dormant state. Though your journey will put you in harm's way, Link, you must endure. It is your fate as a hero, chosen hero of the Gata. <laughs> what? It is shaking. I fear the feel seal has been broken. I expected that I would react to your summoning the gate. But I never imagined the scene would break so quickly. Something wrong with your face, lady. Link, there will be time to explain later. Right now, you must hurry to the bottom of the pit outside. You mean that spooky pit? Oh god! Grab the nunchuck, hurry! While it's still loading! Um. I don't quite remember where I'm going. I think this is the right way. Link, stop slowly opening the door. This is kinda creepy. Hi, Grus. Whoa, what's with all the shaking? I love him! I love his voice! He's the best! The whole ground is here! I thought it was supposed to be a solid down here! Go quickly, Link. Check on the ceiling spike at the center of the pit. There's nothing natural about these tremors. That monster could free itself at any moment. Approach the pit with caution. Monster? Whee! This is caution, right? This is totally caution! So we're back here! Wow! Didn't think I would be ever- ever be back down this place again. Hey. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh. This does- Venus Flytrap! It's the Venus Flytrap! It really was the Venus Flytrap! Oh, no, it's the Imprisoned. Oh, God! I knew it. The seal has given way. I'll explain it later, but now it's the time for action. We must keep that beast from escaping that pit. We must not reach the temple. Ah! Ha ha ha! Um, what do I do? Like, look at the beast's forehead. Do you see the smelling spike embedded there? Drive the spike back into a head and stop. put a stop to its rampage. Maybe I should have saved first. I have the feeling that I should have saved first. Get back in there! Stupid Venus fly trap! Back to the center! Away! It's actually really cool though. What? 
to doing. I don't think that's allowed. Where am I? Oh god. Stupid Venus fly trap. I thought I I didn't actually think I would have to do anything about you. Ah! What the hell is it doing? How many times is it gonna do that? Oh, so this is why this place exists. That place that I first went to in the very beginning? This is why it's here. Very first time I went to the Seal Grounds and I thought this was all useless. Way to prove me wrong, game. How many times am I going to need to drive this stupid stake back into its head? Is this the last time? It's a different cutscene. Get out of here, you stupid Venus flytrap! Who isn't actually a Venus flytrap at all? Kaboom! Yay! I killed it? What? Mm. Now, Link! Strike the ceiling spike with a skyward strike and restore the seal, quickly! Booms. The triangle. Ah, I need to swing the wheel note in the position of the triangle. Kind of hard to do when you're sitting down and like have the microphone right in between your knees. Get down there. Yeah! Take that, Venus Flight Trap! Be in prison. I like my name better. Oh. Nice going, Link. Mm -hmm. Though the imprisoned have only just begun to awaken and break its bonds, I'm impressed you were able to restore the seal, keeping it captive. Fortunately, you have only succeeded in buying us a little more time in which to act. The behemoth you beat back into in, into confinement is a horrible is a horror un, of unspeakable power. Judging, judging by what I saw, I would not be surprised if the seal gave way again soon. So you are left with precious little time to complete the task with which you have been entrusted. Return to the seal temple, Link. There is much to discuss. Is this the thing that Gearham is trying to awaken? Are we sure leaving Groose alone with it is a good idea? Mm. 
As you can see, the gate is nothing more than a slab of cold stone for now. It is sleeping. Rousing it from its slumber would require great power. Yes, I believe a shot of holy light from your Skyward Strike might just do it. Ah, sorry to disappoint you, boy, but for now your sword lacks the power necessary to awaken the gate. First, you and your sword must grow together. V is part of my sword. I don't want to grow to... Fee. With Fee. Fee is stupid. Though I haven't heard Fee in a while. Farron Woods, Elden Volcano, and Laneru Desert. A sacred flame is hidden somewhere in each of these lands. Seek them out and purify your sword in their heat. I have the feeling I, rem I can... I don't know where the... Elden Volcano one is. It's in that place where I couldn't get to because it yelled at me. V yelled at me, actually. Only after your blade has been tempered by these three fires will it be fully imbued with the great power for, for which you search. <laughs> Clues to finding the sacred flames have been woven into the lyrics of a song precious to your people. The Ballad of the Goddess. These clues. <laughs> Return to Skyloft. Somewhere on your island is one whose knowledge of this old song will point you in the right direction. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yay! Or not. I hate even saying this, but I guess you got it all figured out, Granny. I mean, well, there's nothing I can do to help Zelda. I'm useless. Ah, you sell your sort of short, my friend. You'll see in time that you have your own role to play in all this. My Wii mode is rumbling. Mm. Link, go now. Trust in fate to guide your feet. Your mission depends on it, as does Zelda's fate. <laughs> okay, I guess we're not done in Skyloft. Whatever. What is it, Fee? I was just... I was just talking about how... How I haven't heard from you in a while. I don't want to hear from you again. The Ballad of the Goddess. Based on my projection, this is likely the song Zelda sang on the day of the wing ceremony. You don't freaking say! We just saw the flashback! We have memories! We have brains! We don't need you to tell us these things! Let's continue. I can calculate an 85% probability that someone associated with the act Academy will be able to uh, provide additional information about this song. Well, there was either Mr. Ceiling Guy, Mr. Fake Ceiling Guy, or Zelda's dad. I'm gonna go with Mr. Ceiling Guy first. But either way, um, where's the bird statue? Bird statue. This is the wrong kind of bird statue. No, stop climbing pillars. Um. Goodbye. Um, see you, Granny. Oh, come on. I couldn't do a thing! I'm totally useless! Drop. The. Microphone. Not a good idea. I'm just dead weight. What kind of use is that to anyone? Ellipses. Yeah, you got a bug.
I still question why this part of it exists. <laughs> but at least I'm not questioning this again. I know why it's there now. Can I have bird statue? I guess all the stuff that was here is all for that battle against Venus Flytrap. Are y'all just sort of like ways to get up to fight him? I don't know. Whatever. First time, why didn't I just drop down? I'm an idiot. Kinda lost. I need a bird statue and I don't know where to find one. There's a bird statue right over there, so... Great gone! I found some! Look, those butterflies that respond to beautiful tones are swarming all over this place. This has to be the right spot. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, this could be a problem. I cannot carry a tune. I could not create beautiful tones if wild animals threatened to roll me down a hill. What can we do? It's a Sheikah stone. Boing, boing. That is it! One of the talking statues the ancient text spoke of. There is no, just no mistake in it. Gave us an ornamental skull. Okay. Butterflies tend to gather around gossip stones like myself. If you find a spot, a spot swarming with butterflies, play a tune of the great beauty and a gossip stone might... Just pop out of the ground with a boing line. Okay then. It's just like the old text say, buddy. They it appeared with a boing line and spoke in some strange tongue. This is a major leap forward in the study of talking statues. Next up, there's those goddess walls. I got an inkling I will not have to look very far for those either, and I mean to find one no matter what. All right. I'll be saving, of course. And next time, I will meet you guys in Skyloft, skipping the whole flying there thing. And... Well, yeah, I'll, I'll just see you guys next time. Bye!